A job listing in Jasper County has gone untouched for months. The county engineer position pays well. It's a six figure salary, yet the county is having a hard time finding candidates who will even send in their resume. WHO 13's Taylor Musgrove is, is live in Newton with uh, more on what this problem could really be. Hi, Taylor. Good morning, Jody. Since February, Jasper County has been jumping through all hoops to recruit people for this position and have yet to receive a single application. We've been posting on multiple job sites, multiple places, um, trying to get interest and, you know, putting a salary out there like we did with that kind of range. We thought we would get some uh, candidates right away, but we haven't. And this county engineer would cover nearly a thousand miles of roads, 400 bridges, and would have to manage between 45 to 50 employees. It's also a contracted position where benefits can be negotiated. Jasper County is currently offering $10,000 in moving assistance along with a $5,000 signing bonus. Mark Nero with the Iowa County Engineers Association says obtaining county engineers has been a problem in Iowa for years. And to solve this problem, Nero says counties need to do a better job with recruiting local college students. Spend an extra $15,000 or so and hire that engineer intern. You'll get somebody who can do more than just observe the project, test materials. You'll get somebody who can also be that designer and be that person that can fill in behind the your current county engineer. Now, Jasper County has tried to focus on Iowa, but they say their next steps is hiring a headhunter to recruit professionals around the country, Jody. A really interesting problem uh, to have here. Like you mentioned, the salary is pretty good, but it uh, looks like all that experience, uh, they're kind of relying on hopefully having interns to kind of take over the next step. So it'll be interesting to see uh, when uh, this position gets filled. Thanks so much, Taylor.